Hello everyone, this is Devan Edwards, aka Devan the Connector, connecting you, yes, you, to the knowledge that will empower yourself. And we are here, 4pm on the dot, episode 22 on October 11th. Ah, it's magical. And as you don't know, my name is Devan Edwards, aka Devan the Connector, connecting you to the knowledge that will empower yourself. Today's Spoken Word Sunday episode 22 live poetry at 4 p.m sharp and we have 4 p.m every week so yeah we're we'll going with we'll be going every two weeks straight that's see that's that's a that's a i'd have to give myself a round of applause for that one and um i hope everyone's had a great week this this today will be a new poem again um this one i actually i was literally up around 7 a.m I'd sleep until that time and I, ha- I just had to finish it because there's it it a few notes that I wrote before and then I was like okay I just need to finish this so I was literally up finishing it and then yeah I went, I went, went to went to bed literally this today um, and then woke up again but I feel refreshed because I had my spring water and whatnot but um the topic of this this poem today is I titled it I titled it Deep inside, and I feel feels it, it, it made sense for this weekend, I believe, as well. Because I didn't even realize that yesterday was apparently Mental Health Awareness Day, and um, a lot of people were talking about the topic of um, mental health, brain health, and whatnot. And I think this poem communicates somewhat to it, um, in the sense that. Many people don't know that um, a depressed brain is an inflamed brain. So you have that link between mental health and brain health. And many people are actually confused that it goes deeper than like be it having a mental illness or whatnot. It is literally a, f- a, a process that takes place within our emotional body where... We are way, way, where our self identity is weighed down to a state that is not our truest self. So if you see like the emotional guidance scale, like depression and, all, and mental health, the is is at the bottom. But our our highest vibration, our highest self, has no room for for that. It has no room, and not of, often people don't really look into that. And um, associate with with the with the the mindsets, the skill sets, the tools that they need to upgrade their brain health for their mental health and create a better experience for themselves. And um, again, sometimes sometimes it's society pushes that on us, and in other ways, it's us putting that on ourselves. It's a bit of both. But again, it's still our responsibility to connect to connect to the knowledge that will empower ourselves. And so, without further ado, I'm gonna get into this poem. Um, again, as I said, this poem is called "Deep Inside," and I hope you enjoy it. Deep inside. Deep inside resides a vast universe that we often find difficult to search deep inside. Because the human default programming presents us with problems we never intend to seek and find. And mainstream media madness creating distracts to distract us from maintaining an inner peace of mind. All over the world, from nation to nation. I have observed that our greatest power can be er erupted by our greatest expectations. Yet we allowed others to leech that internal power and make unfavourable changes. The expectations of others are those bars we used to create our own cages. But today, right now we are turning new pages. Life becoming golden like a new ages. Coming upon us. 
coming from us coming from within what if this great reset was a great awakening should we take notes of the aspects of our lives that the universe has shaken and nurture what has been neglected in order to awaken filling up the tanks of our burning desire by associating with mindsets, skill sets and tools that we require. Because we all know deep inside that we want to experience more out of life. Yet many conform when cognitive dissonance strikes. Convincing themselves that they deserve less, but really they have been disempowered and agreed with, them, with themselves not to give it their best. But why perpetuate this satirical unrest? Why not dive into the unknown realm of pure faith? Where confidence, consistency and commitment are put to the test. The test to unlock what is deep inside. Because deep inside resides a vast universe of solutions that will reward us greatly when we search deep inside. Yes, deep inside. When you are ready, take a peek. It's time. Thank you. Um, that was the poem, Deep Inside. Um, drop your feedback in the comments below um, on how, if you liked it or not, or what what impacted you most about this this poem. Um, thank you for for tuning in. And yeah, drop those hearts, drop those uh, drop those hearts, whatever. And I love I love to hear your feedback on what what you you gain from from this from 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 the words that you heard. And Please share and like and but and also like share with intention as well. Share with like it, it, once you watch this, like who who comes to mind that you can share this with that they could use a word or a message today. And yes, I hope you everyone is empowered. <laughs> And uh, thank you again. So this is Devan Edwards, aka Devan the Connector, connecting you to the knowledge that will empower yourself. Next week, episode twenty three. Twenty three, you know, twenty three. And um, yes, I will potentially come up with a new poem as I'm working on my new poetry book. But thank you, thank you everyone for tuning in. And just remember, just remember the connection continues. Take care. Have a great day.